All right, Mr. Doug, crawl out of that sleeper. We gotta go. Yeah, yeah, we gotta go. Gotta keep them wheels rolling, Doug. Well, we're going, so get up. I don't want to go either, but gotta make some money so the wife can buy some. I don't know, lottery tickets or whatever she buys. But we got a roll, so we'll get up here in the front seat and let's do this thing. Good load today, Doug. Doing all little piece of heavy equipment. <laughs> he got a bad attitude this morning, ain't you? <laughs> well, it might make a difference if it pays more. I just shut up over there, Doug. Driving us a nice little Kenworth cab over there today, Doug. E700, I think. But uh, one thing about it, if we have a wreck, me and you are going to be the first ones to get there sitting up here like this. <laughs> that would be alright. Just tighten up that seatbelt, son. Tighten her tight. Travel inspection it up. We got an inspector. Make sure all the tires are on the hook Connections, lights. Gotta make sure everything's working. Well, it looks like all's in order. We got ready to roll.
How come I, every time I aim the camera at your seat, Doug, you had it? I don't want your mouth to destroy me. Why not? I'm a child, Papa. I'm just with you. <laughs> Well, it rides like a wagon, Mr. Duck, cause it's old school. You know, the old school when everything was nice. Now you watch this, Mr. Duck. I got a surprise for you. I'm gonna blow through this tow booth like it ain't even there. I bought a pass, a ready pass. They just take a little picture of a little sticker in my wedding and charge me and off I go. Now what do you think about that, Mr. Duck? That's what I thought. Phone up. Hello. What? Am I nagging? <laughs> no. No, 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 no. I'm not nagging. I'm driving a truck. <laughs> I don't know, ma'am. Who is this? One nine hundred girls again. I didn't call you last night. No, I don't care what you're wearing. Has it got feet in them? <laughs> no, I really don't care what you're wearing, ma'am. I didn't call you last night. Can I talk like a duck again for you? Uh, I see what the problem is here. Uh, ma'am, I didn't call you. It was a duck that called you. What do you mean I'm crazy? Ducks can't talk. Well, it isn't can. And apparently it can talk to you. So, uh... I don't know what to tell you, ma'am. Just take the take the bills off my phone. I'm gonna break his little wings here. He won't be able to talk. I don't tell nobody that now. I might get in trouble with a uh, Peter or somebody. But anyway, have a nice day. Put your clothes on and find yourself a good job. <laughs> and get off my damn phone. All right, Mr. Duck. You got some splaining to do with that Judge Judy says splaining. Well, well, well. No, well, yeah, you did. Well, well, well. 
open. Who else talk like a duck? I don't. We'll work this out later, duck. It's coming out of your check, too, by the way. <laughs> the wife's gonna be mad at you, son. This little truck show ain't got much room in it here in the sleeper and stuff. It's, it's not like that super cab we was driving. I don't know how we're going to sleep. Well, I ain't sleep on you either. You can sleep outside in the cold. You're, you're a duck anyway. Go sit in the pond, float around all night. Do something. Like a duck does. And you ain't get no better looking either, I can tell you that. You ought to grow a goatee like mine. See, I grow this great big goatee on my face. And people look at it and say, that's a nice goatee. And I says, oh, all it's forced cover up ugly. It ain't, you know, it ain't. That's the only reason it's there. The more air, <laughs> less ugly. <laughs> Look at those morning skies, Duck. Don't those look good? This is one beautiful world we're driving in. Simulated world, but one beautiful. I really like it, huh? Looks different every time I drive on it. I'm this trip here. We're going somewhere I have never been. It's going to be exciting, to say the least. For me, anyway. See all the new country. Got a new, uh, a new uh, uh, mod on here. If y'all notice, it's. Uh, what is it? Brutal environment. It's making those reflectors on the on the guardrails and changing the looks of a lot of things, brightening it up. And, and then I got a out of that same pack. It's got the tow free, the tow booth free pass. So that's a great download for you guys. A brutal environment. This is supposed to be David Esther's Kenworth. Um, custom. I don't know what all steel custom, what all part he did on the custom. But David, I couldn't find. Coming out of the where I bought it, I tried to mod, I tried to customize it, and I couldn't find no paint job. So I went outside and tried to customize it and I couldn't find any paint job. So I had to paint it red and drive it, so I'm sorry about that. 
I went to blow my paint where it got blocked up. The peat had, but I couldn't find it. So I just decided to make one run and the red version, which looks pretty good. The key switch works on the dash when you start it. Everything works. It's a pretty amazing mod. And uh, I've got a video I made after this that I've hauled an extra heavy load on it. And the front wheels wouldn't turn coming up banks. It was scooting. Have you fellas ever had that happen to you? And if you got going too fast, it was scooting the curves. Some reason when I stopped recording it, it turned into a ABF file. I don't know how to convert it back. I can't get it open to run the motor back there. But I need to make a movie with that one because I completed the whole road yeah, with some very bad steering. I was hauling two dozers with this little rig, and it was more than she could have. She could pull the heel. But it would take the weight off the front and uh, and, uh, and it wouldn't steer. You'd have to back up and get it aiming the right way. Then try to get up the hill. But after you got on blacktop, it done better. But it still scooted and slid. And it made for an interesting video. I hope I can get it set up where I can record it. I don't know why it turned into a VF out. I can't figure that stuff out. Let me give a shout out to Tux McBTUX MCBEA A Fat Penguin or something like that. He, he makes great videos. Check some of his out sometimes. The Rusty Doug, I mean the Rusty Truck said that. The Doug, he ain't said nothing. He's been quite a very worried about that. Worrying about the call of them porn old women on it. His wife's finding out, and I'm gonna tell her. phone again, Duck. I'll get it. Hello. Joe's pool room and hoe house. Where we've got holes anywhere from two dollars to fifteen. Keeps your garden free of weeds. Joe's pool room and hoe house. Go ahead. What? 
looking for somebody called Rusty Truck. He hit one of your cars. I've never heard of him. Like I said, you've got a pool room and a whole house, but this is the kind of holes you use in your garden, ma'am. Three to ten dollars. But you can play pool here, too, and you can use the hole to hit the cue ball. <laughs> Whatever. But you think I'm Rusty Truck? Well, I ain't no Rusty Truck. Um, I told you my name is Joe, and uh, if you try the number again, you'll get Joe's pool room again. So, uh, I don't know what I'll tell you about that Rusty. Look him up. You'll find him somewhere. He's everywhere. I've seen him everywhere. He's on this page, that page, phone book, yellow pages. Uh, look him up. You'll find him. But, uh, if I see him, I'll tell him, what's your name? Myrtle. He, I'll tell him you're looking for him, Myrtle. Alrighty. Thanks for calling. You can come down and play the pool. I need the money. Now, get off my damn phone. Think I fooled her, Mr. Duck? Yeah. I think I did. <laughs> well, thank you, Duck. Well, people, if you've not got mad and turned it off by now, we'll be finishing up here in a minute. I'm going to cut it at 25 minutes. And we'll zoom right back in with part two. Where'd that duck hiding at? We'll zoom back in with part two. And I appreciate you watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Hope you got a laugh. And... Uh, click like and share and try to type in a little comment or something tell me what you think nobody seems to do that but uh, this is rusty truck and somebody who is it yeah I know it we'll be back soon y'all come back here yeah.